Last night at committee, former Conservative Fisheries Minister Sidden warned us that the Trojan budget bill, quote, makes a Swiss cheese out of Federal Fisheries Act. Whoa. Because today's Conservatives are abandoning their constitutional duties to protect our fish and fish habitat. And Mr. Sidden had this simple challenge for the Minister. Will the Minister stand up and say, I understand what my job entails, and I am here to look after fish full stop? Here, here. The Honourable Prime the Secretary of the Minister of Fisheries. Well, thank you, Mr. Speaker, and I thank my colleague for his questions. Uh, the, the measures we've introduced in Bill C-38 allow Fisheries and Oceans Canada to focus its efforts in a practical, sensible way on managing threats to Canada's recreational, commercial, and Aboriginal fisheries. And I know they like to use uh, former Minister Sidden uh, to uh, criticize this new direction that we're taking here, but let me just read him this. This policy applies to those habitats directly or indirectly supporting those fish stocks or populations that sustain commercial, recreational, or native fishing activities of benefit to Canadians. Who wrote that, Mr. Speaker? Well, the Honourable Tom Sidden in the 1986 Habitat Policy that's still oh. in force here. Yeah. 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 The Honourable Member for Dartmouth Coal Harbour. Thank you, Mr. Speaker. I appreciate the fact that, uh, that the member supports what Mr. Sidden has to say, because it's clear that they are dismantling fish habitat protections they're selling out our fisheries for short-term corporate profits, and Canadians are not buying the minister's claim that this is all about farmers' ditches. Yeah, yeah. And neither is former Minister Sidden, who called what they're doing a shallow, phony excuse for change. So I ask the minister, Mr. Speaker, drop the charade, accept the advice from the Conservative pre predecessor, and split the bill and do the right thing.